Today I'll be reading from from Second King, from chapter one, verse one till the end, and I read. The mob rebelled against Israel after the death of Ahab, and Isaiah fell down through the lattice, of, lattice, a lattice in the upper chamber that was in Samaria, and was sick. And he sent messengers and said unto them, Go inquire of Bathsheba, the god of Ekron, whether I shall I shall recover of this disease. But the angel of the Lord said to Elijah the Tishabite, Arise, go up to meet the messengers of the king of Samaria, and say unto them, It is not because there is no God in Israel that, that ye go into inquire of Bezebel, the god of Ekron. Now therefore, thus said the Lord, Thou shalt not come down from the bed on which thou art gone up, but shalt, but shalt surely die. And Elijah departed. And when the messengers turned back unto him, he said unto them, Why are ye now turned back? And they said unto him, There came a man up to meet us, and said unto us, Go, turn again unto the king that sent you, and, and say unto him, Thus say the Lord, It is not because there is no God in Israel. That say, send this, in, that send this inquire of Bathsheba, the God of Ekron. Therefore thou shalt not come down from the bed, from that bed on which thou art gone up, but shalt surely die. And he said unto them, The manner of man, what? What manner of man was he which came up to meet you and told you these words? And they answered him, He was an hairy man and get with get of leather about his loins. And he said, Is it Elijah the Tishabite? Then the king sent unto, unto him a captain of fifty with fifty, of fifty with fifty. And he went up to him, and behold, he sat on the top of a hill and spake unto him, That man of God, the king, the king had said, Come down. And Elijah answered and said unto the captain of fifty, if I be a man of God, then let fire come down from heaven and consume thee and thy fifty. And they came down the fire from heaven and consumed him and fifty. Eleven. Again also he sent unto him another captain of fifty with fifty with his fifty. And he answered and said unto him, O man of God, thou had the king said, Come down quickly. And Elijah answered and said unto them, If I be a man of God, let fire come down from heaven. And consumed thee and, and thy fifty. And the fire of God came down and from heaven and consumed him and his fifty. And he sent him again a captain of the third fifty with his fifty. And the third captain of the fifty went up and came and fell on his knees behold, before Elijah. And besought him and said unto him, O man of God, I pray thee, let my life and the life of these fifty thy servants be precious in thy sight. Behold, there came fire down from heaven and bent up the two captains of the forty. Of the former fifties with the fifties, therefore let my life now be precious in thy sight. And the angel of the Lord said unto Elijah, Go down with him, be not afraid, be not afraid of him. And he arose and went down with him unto the king. And he said unto him, Thus said the Lord, for, some, for as much as thou hast sent messengers to inquire the bosom the bosom of the God of Ekron, is it not it is it not because there is no God in Israel to inquire of this word? Therefore, Thou shalt not come down off that bed in which thou art gone up, but shalt surely die. 17. So he died according to the word of the Lord, which Elijah has spoken. And Jeroham reigned in his stead, reigned in his stead in the second year of Jeroham, and the son of Jehoshaphat, king of Judah, because he had no son. Now the rest of the, of the acts of Isaiah, which, which he did, are there not written in the book of the chronicles of the king of Israel. Amen. Amen.